Let's go. What is going on? Hope you guys are fired up. I'm fired up. We have our second episode of the new year of the Dan Geesing Live Gaming Show. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. Hope you guys are excited because tonight's the night. Yes, to quote the famous series Dexter. I think tonight's the night we finally get a chance to beat Super Meat Boy. And after the last show, I feel like we made some serious progress. And... <laughs> But not without a cost. After the after Monday's Dan Keesing Live Gaming Show, I tweeted at Edmund and the programmer Super Meat Boy because my freaking – I think it's the first time since I was a kid where my hands and wrists actually hurt from playing a game from, like, the NES throwback games. So I'm excited to hopefully try and beat this game tonight uh, for the first half of the show. And then the second half of the show tonight, we're going to be playing, uh, once again, some Spelunky Death Roulette, where you guys, the audience, get a chance to wager on how we are going to die. And But we still have to beat Spelunky. I haven't, haven't beaten it yet. And who, those loyal bettors, and if you have no idea what I'm talking about, those loyal bettors who always bet on that we're going to win, one of these days, the bet will pay off. Um, other thing, I wanted to we're going to be unveiling tonight is and speaking of Spelunky is the top 10 community leaderboard for those who have acquired the most Spelunky dollars on stream. So thanks to one of the moderators stepped up and is going to be managing that. Um, so I have the top 10 in the Renegade Gamer community Spelunky leaderboard, which is, I'm excited to unveil that um, later on in the show. And so that's kind of the news for what's been going on. The schedule uh, for the rest of the week, just to give you guys a heads up, uh, Friday morning is the next show, which will be at 10 a.m. Eastern for Dan Ditches Friday. We're going to continue on with some XCOM. Really fired up about that. The only time I've been playing XCOM is on Dan Ditches Friday. And I think we're putting a, a, a dent in that game, but it's so much fun. And if you haven't checked out Dan Ditches Friday, I'd, I'd encourage you to come out because it's fun when you know people are – ditching work along with me even though they're at work and they're watching it's just a, it's a cool and it's a different feel uh type show than dan geesing live gaming show and in particular with xcom we're making you know characters based on in the game based on what you guys want and to me it's some of the most fun i've had streaming and just in terms of the gameplay and and the community involvement it's just a lot of fun so if you're around on friday we're going to be going from 10 a.m to 3 p.m on friday we work hard all week and so i ditch work on friday and uh, play games for the majority of the day. Although running a show is still work, but you guys get the point. Um, the other thing I want to talk about was on Saturday, we're going to change things up. So for those of you guys that are new to the channel, two Saturdays a month, we have Saturday subscriber games. And this Saturday is going to be the second one for January. Uh, but the Saturday subscriber games on Saturday are going to start at 9 a.m. And I was kind of going back and forth in terms of what we're going to do. But after I test ran through the new subscriber only minecraft server i'm deciding to cancel quake live and we're just going to play minecraft all day on saturday on the new server and real quick a big thank you to kevin for setting that up because it's it's everything that freaking i was looking for with a server mod and if you're a subscriber i sent an email out before the show with the steps on how you can get set up to get in the server because you do have to install a mod pack. It's really, really easy. It's like the simplest thing in terms of Minecraft modding I've ever done. It's really easy. It's going to be a lot of fun. And I figured let's give you guys a quick sneak peek um, of what the server looks like. And I don't want to give away too much about the server, but it took me like we ran around it for about 15 or so minutes, but I didn't want to go outside the, initial area where you start because there's so it's so different from vanilla minecraft and i want to experience it along with you guys on saturday so i really had to pull the reins back and not go crazy exploring but everything's set up and ready to go and i'm excited to share that with you guys so here's a quick sneak peek of what the new server is going to look like and it is going to be a ton of fun so just if you're used to vanilla minecraft only which is what i've been doing is only playing vanilla minecraft you notice a couple changes right away uh, there's a map on the freaking overlay, which is going to be huge. Um, you notice there's already a castle built. We didn't build that castle. It's on there. Of course, we, you know, you may see a, f a familiar 
<laughs> a familiar logo in the sky. Um, but there's so much. I'm just I can't explain to you how excited I am to get in there and play Minecraft with you guys on Saturday. And the interesting thing that I didn't expect it to be like, but I think it was a pleasant twist, is that you know. If you know, you know, you've heard me talk from time to time about my affinity or my love for Ultima Online back in the day when I played in the late 90s. And it was an, one of the first MMOs, but the reason why I liked it is because there were no rules. You could essentially do whatever you want in an open world, wild, wild west type of format. And that's how our Minecraft server is going to be. Uh, and we're just going to leave it at that. And we're just going to see what happens. And I'm just so fired up to, to do that with you guys. So, um... That's a sneak peek of the Minecraft server, which it will not open up. The Minecraft server will not open up until Saturday um, during our Saturday subscriber games. But you have all the information if you're a subscriber. It's been messaged to you on how to get things set up. So um, also, if you have any problems with that, and even if you're in the community and want to, um, and not a subscriber, I encourage you to go to the Reddit page and, you know, post any concerns there. And if you're having trouble signing up, and one of the moderators can drop the link to the Reddit um, for you guys there. So, uh, that's a sneak peek of the new Minecraft server. And before we get started with Super Meeple, I do want to thank uh, a few people very quickly. Um, I want to thank Mike V, Frank, Kent, Scotty, Brandon, Athena, Jessica, Thomas, Colleen, Colin, Aaron, Ryan, Amber, Miranda, and Stacy. Thank you guys so much for retweeting the stream. I appreciate it. You know, what we're trying to build here is a positive gaming community where everyone can have a chance to, um, you know, watch and have fun and be a part of the community. And thank you guys so much for spreading the word. I appreciate that. So that being said, I think it's time for a little Meat Boy. Um, so let's get him going, shall we? What is someone? I saw someone dropped a message saying they came out of Lurk. What's up, Roster? I missed the message. Alright, here we go. Let's get this thing started. Oh, Morgan B, what's up? Super Welcome. Me Boy. Workers are still awesome, but awesome to have you out of work. Alright, here we go. So, if you're... We've gotten through all the levels. We're on Chapter 6. We're going toe-to-toe -to -toe against Dr. Fetus. That's how far we are. Did I play Super Meat Boy yesterday? I played Super Meat Boy on Monday for the last day of this live gaming show. I'm hoping we can beat it tonight. I think tonight's tonight. We've already seen it. I did send out an email with all the mod or the information for the Minecraft server. It may take a while for Twitch to push that out though. Music is loud to me. Thank you for that. How's the voice to game sound level now? Thank you guys, That's so loud, I appreciate that. Sorry, I don't mean to blow your guys' eardrums out. So I'm gonna make sure that our levels are good before we get started here. How much is left of Super Meat Boy? Um, this says it's the end, but there may be one world after this. Kill Meat Boy, you can't kill him. Someone dropped a spoiler last stream and said there actually is a chapter seven. Uh, but I cannot confirm nor deny that. The music is still very loud. Okay, what about now? More voice, less music. Got it. Still kind of loud, but better. Let me cut this in half then. Because the music in this game is so good. Okay, here we go. If this is not good, you can tell me after I die for the 30th time in one minute. You gotta be able to hear the great music in this. <laughs> okay, so let's see where we left off, see if we still have it. Usually, in most games, our first run is usually our best and a good sign of what's to come. So let's see how we do here. Nah, that's not a good sign. Okay, cool. We got the audio's good. It's got those heat seekers. How did we die there? That was strange. Okay, so we're just getting warmed up here. The warm is real. Oh god. What's up, Shaddy Paw? Okay, here we go. 
Wow. What's up, Burke? All right. Wow. What is going on here? Let's get our. We gotta get our our druthers about us. He's got that extra heat seeker. Not a good sign is right, Zach. There we go. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Just get just getting oiled up here. A little too oiled. No red shirt today. I wanna mix it up. This is one of my most comfortable t-shirts. So I just feel like wearing this today. But good, good, good pull, Sparty Go. Here we go. Okay, we're just getting rolling here. That money jump. Need it. Okay. 50 Spelunky dollars that I beat this in the next 50 tries. Wow, that's fairly confident, Brandon. I'm not sure I share your confidence. All right, let's do this. Gangster slide. Nice. Wait for it. Get up there. Oh, we gotta move. Oh, making freaking moves. This is actually not a WoW shirt, it's just a random <clears throat> Alliance Karate shirt that I like. Burke, are, do you, uh, what kind of content do you currently create, sir? Are you on YouTube or Twitch or what do you do? All right, here we go. We got action. Oh, calm yourself. Calm. Drop name. Come on, you gotta wait for it. You gotta make the magic happen. Go. Panic. Go, go, go. Okay, we got action here. Gangster slide down. Now what do we do here? Freak out. That's, that's a, we have no plan of execution there. There's no execution. I don't know the plan there. That's a problem. That heart was racing though. Get hit with that Roger Clemens fastball. What is up with that? All right, here we go. I would just focus on making good content and not worry so much about what network or anything you're with. That's my best advice. Reminds you of God of War. Nice. I've never got into those games, but I know people freaking love them. Kratos? That's the main guy's name, right? Wow. Greg Maddox fastball. That throwback, Zach. Okay, so we're still early on in the game. I mean, in our show tonight, which means I haven't... I've yet to get delusional. <laughs> so, if you're new to the channel, the longer we play, the more delusional I get and thus the more nonsense that comes out. But right now we're trying to focus here. The music in this is so good. I feel like we could, we don't have to wait there. Except it's a lot of pressure on us to make that jump right there. Slide, gangster slide, nice. Go for it, nice. Nice, okay. Now how, how would one beat this part? No, it's the next part, we don't know. Shoot, I don't know what to do. Oh, okay, I got it. I got it. The plan is there. You just have to gently jump. The gentle jump. Do the gentle jump, and then you got action. I think, I think we're going to beat this, this level for sure today. 
We probably had, what, like 200 deaths on Monday night? Go for it. Nice, that freaking Olympic jump. Nice. Try to get height there, that's what we try to do. And then you make a move. Nice. Okay, here we go. Meat boy. Drop name. Oh, whoa. Nice. Nice! Oh, God! We're getting so close. The progress is there. The progress is there. What's up, Laxstar? Roach, what's up, sir? You meant to put a zero behind the, the 50. Brandon, that's more accurate. Alright, let's do this. Make, make the moves. Don't panic. Alright, Magic, we'll try not to panic here. Keyword being try. Get your face up. Go, 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 go. Nice. Okay, here we go. Okay, good, good, good. It's good things. Oh, we got time. We got time. Gentle jump. Let's go! Okay, now what? This is the first we've ever been. Be cautious, there's gonna be a rocket launcher. I know it. Oh god, we gotta hit the button. How the freak do we hit that button? There it is. You troll. Die! Oh no! We were so close! We were so close! We had it all! We had it all! We had it all! That was it! That was the run! It's alright. GeoJam. It's from a lot of deaths. You only get better by dying thousands of times in this game. We get this this is rap city though. We got this beat. And just like that, just like in any game when you get cocky, it just brings you back down to earth as fast as possible. That closeness. Nice. Slide. Slide. Jump. Those saw blades of doom. I can't help but think there's a shortcut. Instead of having to wait for this Olympic jump here. Like that. See, we're, we're done, so. Damn. What's up, Grits? Good to see you back, sir. What's up, Carlo? Alright, we make our move. That Clemens fastball, sir. Man, that is a freaking heater. He sends the, the heater at us. I never remember having to dodge twice. What's up, Taco? Hey, Taco, man. Uh, I know you do the channel, but usually I'll ask for tips or any knowledge on the level, so don't drop spoilers, man. But I know you're new, so you probably didn't know that. You get, and if you're new to the channel, you might want to check out kind of the, the guidelines for the channel. Get your face up, or on the left side underneath on Twitch. Damn it. I think that was a, a breaking ball. Good point. There you go. Damn. I literally jumped out of my seat on that one. Get your face up. Nice. No worries, Taco. I know you're new, so I know you didn't do it on purpose, man. Make the Olympic jump. Oh, we freaking hit our face on the face screen. Damn. No worries, man. Okay, here we go. This is that run. This is the run. See, I feel like we could squeeze up there and not have to wait for the Olympic jump. 
because that Olympic junk puts so much freaking junk in the trunk. Blackstar, we try to keep this up. Like, how does that even real life? I try not to swear because I know we have young viewers, so I try to keep the, the show PG to PG-13. Every once in a while, a slip does occur. An FCC blast is... That's not true. Okay. I'm gonna go for a little secret go. Let's see if... I feel like that's a... We can make that, not have to wait here. That's a really tough jump. Alright, here we go. Nice. Get get hot. Get some get some air. We didn't get air. That's okay though. Nice. Breathe. Breathe ins and outs. Nice. God damn it! Freak! So close. It was on the cusp. Zach, I bet we have not, I would say atypical demographics for a Twitch channel, but I guess it all depends. Can't imagine getting a free one. A free what? Get your face set. Stop, meat boy. Stop. Okay, we're getting this. We're getting here consistently. This is a good sign. Nice. Gentle giant jump. Nice. Okay, here we go. We know what to do now. We gotta go. We gotta hit the top butts. Hit the top butts. Got it. Oh, jerk. He freaking hit us with the curveball right in the face. What's up, Dylan? I hope there's a champion key on this level. Man, we got lamb basted on that one. Phantom, as of right now, there's no plans to do any more Watch With Dance. All right, let's do this. Okay, here we go. That drop the drops nice slide jump okay here we go this is where you make the money this is where you find out oh, if you're ground beef or top sirloin three of the heater it's gonna happen stop me boy I think it was the third, but what is the third verse of that song? Stop Meat Boy, Drop Napalm, and something else. Play Ping Pong, that's what it was. Go for it, nice. Oh, that's such a rookie. That's like minor league stuff right there. never remember that second missile being a problem. That lack of memories. Here we go. Try to get that top sirloin. Oh. Nice Olympic jump. Back to triple A ball. Oh god, we have nothing. Stop Meat Boy, drop Napalm, and play ping pong. That's the number one hit if I've ever heard it. Those are Grammy winning lyrics right there. Not to mention the song is only 10 seconds long. Yeah, maybe it might be 30 seconds. What's up, Cantor? Drop a pump. Olympic jump. Wasn't so Olympic. Got the bronze on that. All right, here we go. 
Nice. High jump. Get down. Slide up. Nice. Okay, here we go. The path of legends. There we go. Okay, here we go. Now, we can't be hasty. He's going to come in and fire a rocket. So we probably shouldn't do the exact same thing we just did, but we're going to try. Oh, we're so freaking close. What's up, cool bro? You mad, bro? Sorry. Man, that was... I felt like that was it. I was getting hasty. Gangster slide all day. That's right, Amber. If you're not gangster slide, and you're not doing it right. We gotta go. It's gonna happen. This is. Wow, he almost hit us with that heater. Yeah. Nice. Calm. The breaths. The breaths. Drop napalm. Look like a sinker. Oh, God. This is the run. That's the run we got our head freaking blown off. <laughs> He's like three for three on his last pitches. Alright, let's do it. Wow, four for four, the synergy. The synergy is real, what's up? The synergy is sending us fastballs on the regular. Nice. Okay. This is where you make your money here, on the Olympic jump. I'm going to try the sneaky way. There we go. We got some sneaks. How about that for a little... We, we sidestepped the Olympics. Sidestepped them. Performance enhancing drugs. That's what we get. See you, Kent. Thanks for hanging out, sir. Man, this game is difficult. S boy difficult. Butchering the language. Okay, here we go. God. Why? Why? We're just a, we're just a piece of meat trying to play some ping pong. Drop some napalm. It's a great storyline for a game. You're a character and you just want to drop napalm, napalm and play ping pong. Sneaks. We got the sneaks. Okay, here we go. Get a quick high jump up here. Slide it. Oh, wow! That means this was meant to be the, the run. Get your face down. Gentle. Gentle. No! Come on! What's up, Bracey T? Meat Boy needs those performance enhancing drugs. Wow, almost. Oh, that was a freaking curve. That save. They forgot to put save state in this game. And that's what makes it awesome, except when you do that. That that hastefulness. We're just getting warmed up. Usually the first segment of of the show, we're just getting warmed up. But I feel like we got a shot to beat it here. Nice. We're gonna t we're gonna take the Olympic sidestep here. Oh, we're not. We gotta go for the Olympic jump. We missed the we missed the qualifier. We missed the qualifier it means we gotta go for broke. Go go 
go. Slide up. Okay, here we go. Nice. Gentle. Gentle! I said gentle like the freaking bear that sells toilet paper. Come on. Rattled. Rat. Told. And then he just... He just rubs it in with the heater. Man. This game puts you on full-on rattle, tilt, anger, rage, everything. Why? There we go. They've increased the difficulty. And each time you restart the game, the difficulty goes up. Drop, nape, palm. Why do I say that? That's probably not something to joke about. One of the most devastating. God, that's what we get. Do better with Olympic jumps. Huh? Get your face up. Got your face up too close. No remnants. That sneaks. Okay, here we go. Quick jump. Quick jump for the kids. I like on this game that the, the blood stays. I know I've mentioned that a few times. I think it's just a nice touch. So you know where you failed. Nice. Oh, God. We just freaking took it. The difficulty increases, I swear it does. I promise you the difficulty increases. It has that next level AI. Nice jump, sir. Blame it on the lag. Always blame the lag. Gotta go to the Olympic jump here. Olympic junk, Olympic, Olympic, Olympic junk. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh man. Drop. That's because we haven't been singing. We need to drop napalm. That that decreases the difficulty when you say drop napalm. The Olympic jump is more difficult and puts more heat on you. So we should probably stay away from that. There, okay, nice. Feats of strength, feats of strength. Hasty count at 30. All right, let's make a move. Thank you, sir. Every time you get excited, you die. <laughs> That's an astute observation. It's hard not to get excited because it's just so exciting when you get past this troll part. All right, here we go. Get your face up. Nice. Okay. The feats of strength. Nice. Gentle jump. It's for the gentle and kind of heart. Nice. Okay, we're gonna make a quick run at this. Or not, because here comes the freaking missile jabroni. Damn it! Oh, freak. Oh, no. We didn't even get the button pushed. Damn it! My heart was beating on that one. I got too excited. Ellen excitement factor. Man, what's up, David? Good to see you back, sir. Good to see you back, David. <laughs> you haven't exactly... You've missed a little progress, but not a ton. But a little progress in this game 
is worth more than two birds in the hand. That's real. That's real philosophy for you. Olympic jump. Nice. Get your face. Get your face down. Get under the covers. <laughs> what? Okay, here we go. Feats of strength. Feats of strength. Gentle jump for the gentle giants. Nice. Okay. What is the strategy here? The strategy is to hit the button. Like that. We hit it. We hit it. You die, sir. You die, sir. You die, sir. You die, sir. Is this it? He dies. You're dead. Oh my god. We freaking did it. We freaking did it. Baby Isaac. Oh my god. You die, sir. Kill him. Skin him. We got Bandage Girl. He's got that teleport. He just flicked us off. Oh god, what is this? I hope this is a save point. Now where do we go? We gotta get home? No way. Please be okay. Good. At least I was just panicked. It wasn't a save point. Okay. We got through the checkpoint. We can breathe. Doctor Fetus is on his last legs. I'm gonna take a quick break. We'll come back with the next part of this. We are gonna beat this game tonight. Bet your bottom dollar on it. I'll be back shortly. God, we beat it. Let's go.
All right, we're back. Just took down the first part of Dr. Fetus. Now we've finally, we've made contact with Bandage Girl. She's on her back. And we're gonna get after it here. Come on, sir. Nice. Wow, this is gonna be, that is difficult. That is a difficult jump for not the faint of heart. Okay, let's do it. Wow! <laughs> this is... She's on her back. We have to perform. I mean, in an appropriate way. How do we how do we survive this? How do we Damn, need a little more push off. Prodigy, you know, I don't know. You know, in terms of making this a job, I have a lot of fun with it and it's cool to that it's monetized too so I can you know, I guess justify spending a lot of time on it, you know. So I guess eventually I'd like it to be a part of what I do. Um, but regardless of it, if it ever gets to that level, monetarily, I, I just enjoy doing it. It's a lot of fun. But that is the end goal. That's why I put time and effort into, you know, the graphics and the show layout, but not, obviously not the gameplay. Um, but yeah, I really enjoy um, the platform that Twitch offers. And uh, I'm fortunate that, well, I'm fortunate that I found it. You know, or not found it, was shown it and introduced to it. Because I, I really enjoy it and the community that we have here. It's, uh, it's what makes everything fun to do. So I appreciate you guys uh, to the utmost. You know, that's why, damn. That's why it's a lot of fun when you freaking die with bandage girl on your back because I don't know, I just, I just enjoy this and I enjoy the community we have here and I know what... I try to do a lot to make this as entertaining as possible for you guys and as fun as possible, but sometimes it's bad play. What's up, Green Sonic? How do we get past this? Damn. That's a tough jump, sir. That hero music, though. Gentle giant. How do we get to the other side? I don't know. Maybe we can. I don't think we can go up top, but I'll try. Yeah, I can't go off the screen. Yeah, synergy. You know, synergy says it's more about the game you broadcast than the quality of the broadcaster. For me, you know, I would I would agree with that. It, it seems like if you play certain games, you you get more viewers, and that's why it's not necessarily important to me. I think that it's been proven. If you build a strong community, you can play a variety of games, and that's what the goal is here. Because to me, I I don't I wouldn't find it fun if you were streaming. So even if we were streaming the same schedule we were now, but only playing the exact same game, like that has to get tremendously boring for the broadcaster. Damn, I can't make that jump. You, you've got it exactly, uh, exactly right, Lax, Laxstar. It's the community that makes this all possible. That's why. God bless it. What's up, Sal? Good to see you back, sir. That's not the way to do it either. Freak. See, right now, this is. The strategy on, on Meat Boy, this is how I, I break down Meat Boy gameplay. You first have to die to figure out the plan. Because once you have the plan, then you just execute the plan. We're at the point right now where we don't have the plan. We're still dying, trying to find how to execute the freaking plan. I don't know how to do that. I have no clue on what the plan is here.
Oh, maybe jump up and across. Oh, we don't even have the hops to do that. There it is. We do have the hops to do that, though. No! Oh, progress. Progress in the face of a butcher blade. That's what you have to think. Progress in the face of a butcher blade. As close to the flames as you can. Damn. Damn. With no plan, there's no attack. And with no attack, there's no victory. Wise words, Ken. Wise words. <laughs> I never have a plan. I'm just going blind. So close. What's up, Gravy? There she is. No, no, no. That celebration. That early celebration. That premature celebration. Mother of Pearl. Yeah, we had a ton of fun um, in the Hearthstone tournament we had last Saturday for the the community. I really had that was I felt it went over really well, and uh, I think everyone had a good time. But of course, of course the get up there, the Reddit gamer who is ranked in North America in Hearthstone won that. Bet you didn't see that coming. Okay, gosh. I wonder if we gangster slide and then jump. I think it's what we need to do. Gangster slide and then jump. Get your face up! Let's go! What is the plan of attack? What? Okay, we, we, we can afford ourselves some, some breathing here. We don't have to go up top. We can just run and jump. That was a metaphor. Yes, Taco. All right, let's do this. Take it easy. Take it easy. What the? They closed that. That never used to be closed. This level changed. Damn it. Freak! Nice! That's the beauty of this game. What you were once horrible at, you are now only slightly less horrible at. Oh, mother of Pearl. What's up, Wadester? See, now we're back to being normal. This is nerve-wracking in the best possible way. Jeff, I, I, I would maybe bet that this game has taken a week off my lifespan. And I couldn't be more happy to... Okay, here we go. Oh, that was a nice one. That was not nice. Oh, that PS3 breakage today. Oh, sorry to hear that, sir. How'd it happen? That's like, that's a somber day when your console eats it. That's a tough day. That's a tough pill to swallow. That's also a tough pill to swallow when you freaking... Hand cramps are... Right now, Coach Cantor, we're fighting through the, the cramps. It's just... It's the mental fortitude. That's what it's about right now. Not... That's not mental. See you, Magic. 
No worries, Fandango. Hopefully it'll be around Saturday. We're uh, unleashing the Minecraft server. It's freaking epic. Synergy. I was watching. I've seen uh, Lethal Frag play that. I want to be the Bashi, and I was watching when I was working out today. I was watching uh, Man vs. Game play that. <laughs> and let's just say, during my entire workout, Man vs. Game was on the same freaking boss. I heard the first one to play out of that series, though, is Shut Up, is I want to be the guy. Yeah, I think after Super Meat Boy, we're, after this game, after we beat this game, we're going to change up the genre a little bit on uh, for the Dan Geesing Live Gaming Show. I don't know what game it'll be, but we may have to take a break from this because the pain is real. Let's go! No, we almost had it. Oh, congrats on that mini wedding, sir. Pour some out for you. Yeah, if you guys don't watch Man vs. Game, if it's uh, you're not experiencing life to the fullest. He's really good. I think every, everyone on Twitch knows about Man vs. Game. Yeah, he's really fun to watch. Um, but I definitely rate rate his stream R rated, which is awesome. Gentle, gentle giant, Why, you don't need that jump. You don't need it. Why force the issue? Why force that issue? You don't need it. Nice. Wow, 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 wow. Would I ever play Kingdom Hearts? I've thought about it. Um, I just, I get confused. I've never played it. I don't know if the... I take that back. I played it at E3 or the remix at E3. I'm not sure I understand the combat. It's like action, but I see parts of it where it looks like it's like Final Fantasy. So I don't know how the combat is. Or if it's a combination of both, I don't know. Jeff, you've been playing a lot of Terraria, huh? I'm more excited about Starbone than Terraria. What's up, Upgrade? Good to see you, sir. Welcome to the channel. This is the... Uh, right now on the, on the show, we're putting on a clinic on how... Not to play Super Meat Boy. Get your face up. Okay, here we go. Now, what is the plan? We can breathe here for a second. Kingdom Hearts is amazing. There's all new content for Rogue Legacy. Okay, what is the plan here, my friends? I think we have to... We have to jump left and then jump back. Should you buy Super Meat Boy? Yes. You can usually catch it for $5 or less if you catch it on sale. So I think I'm going to have to jump up the left wall, jump over that, and then gangster slide, reverse gangster slide up that left wall. Let's try it. Like, th like this. Wait for it to clear. There it is. Okay, now what? Nice. What's the plan here, Stan? I think, I don't think we can make it from here. We're going to have to jump right and then do the Olympic jump. We got this. All right, Ellen. Nice, nice. Reverse Olympics. This should be nice and easy. Don't force the issue. Don't force the issue. Okay, don't force it. He's throwing missiles, he's throwing rockets. 
Wow, that's really difficult. Look how fast that one's spinning. Oh god. Now where'd we go? Oh god. <sighs> Breathe. Take it in. Let it happen. As soon as that comes down, we're going. Oh, that spinner's up top too. Oh man, we have gotta time this off three spinning blades. Right there is the opportunity. Right. Now. Go. Go. Okay. Now this. Nice. Okay, now what? Now what? Oh no. Gotta bounce back. This should be okay. Don't overthink it. Just make it happen. Nice. Nice. No, are you... No, 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 no. All right, let's go. I gotta remember at the end, take take the figure off figure. Take the finger off the trigger when you were making those jumps. It can be gentle giant jumps. That happened in slow motion, I agree, Zach. Oh man, we made a ton of progress there. Hasty. We're getting very hasty. We're getting very, very hasty. I like it. Slow clap at the failure. Wait for it. It's go time. It's go time. Okay. Okay, we're getting close. Okay. Nice. Okay, no, no, no turbo. Turn the turbo off, sir. You turn the turbo off, and you take your time here. You take out turbo off. Has this been trolling us the whole time? It has been, sorry about that. Okay. We got this. He's going to be sitting there with the rocket launcher. The size of our head. You know what's going to happen. Get us out of here. Yes. Yes. Can we do it? Is this it? Oh my god. Save her. No. After all that work, she's trapped? Brownie! Save her! Oh, he's gonna die! Brownie died! 
and Pearl Jam comes in with the song. Feels Eddie Vedder. What he's punching here? Punching her. Nicely done. That game was a lot of fun. R.I.P. Brownie. Nicely done, sirs. Let's ride this thing all the way out to the end. Poor Brownie. Poor F. Brownie. Brownie was a champ. I think I like Brownie better than Meat Boy. He's doing the, what is that? What is that move called? I don't know what that move is called, but all old people do it when they dance. The music in this game is so good, AVR. Larry. Dan Geeson Live Gaming Show gets his first victory. That good playthrough daps on that, sirs. Bandage Girl gets the spotlight. The end! Find out in the dark world. <laughs> Chapter oh. complete! Nicely done, sirs. Alright. Final thoughts on What the heck was that? Cotton Alley? The Cotton Alley. This looks like there's a lot of stuff that you can oh you can play with uh Bandage Girl. Um final thoughts on this game. You can buy this game for usually five dollars or less on Steam, you can catch it on sale. It was awesome. It's really you know, you've heard a lot about it. To actually go through and play it, it's a lot of fun and in terms of the design. And, you know, the, I like how they introduce different things to you throughout the game. I would definitely recommend this game to anyone, especially if you're a fan of kind of like old school Nintendo games. This is have that type of feel and literally physical feels too. Um, but I would definitely recommend it. I had a ton of fun playing. I'd definitely give it at least 9 out of 10. Even the story at the good with at the end was good, you know, with Brownie dying, it just pulled at the heartstrings. I know there's a ton more left to play in this game and unlock. Um, let's just check our total deaths here. 944 deaths, 39%, Light World 84%. At some point, we may come back and revisit this months and months from now and play the Dark World, but to me, I'm satisfied beating this. I hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. Um, what did you guys think? It, it, it is on the Humble Bundle a lot, Lax. I agree with you. Or, I concur. Um, it is available on Xbox Live, too. Um, but really, really enjoyed it. Highly recommend it. Buy it on Steam. I couldn't recommend a game any more highly than this game. Um, I'm going to take a quick break, and we're, kind of, we're going to come back, and uh, we'll have something else going. Thank you guys so much. We'll be back shortly.
All right, let's do this. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, sticking with us. We put the fork and Super Meat Boy, both figurative and, li figuratively and literally. Um, want to give you guys a heads up. If you want have a suggestion for the next game you want to see playing on the played on the Dan Geesing Live Gaming Show starting next Monday, I would encourage you to go to the community Reddit at reddit.com slash r slash Dan Geesling and post there. And if you see someone's already posted a game that you want to see play played through, because that's the thing to keep in mind on the Dan Geesling Live Gaming Show, the first segment of the show, the first half of the show is based all on beating one game. So it has to be a game that is beatable. I'd encourage you to go upvote other people's suggestions in there as well. And the mods can... Uh, can drop a link for the Reddit in case uh, you have never been there. So, that being said, we're going to get some Spelunky Death Roulette going here. And if you've never seen this before, um, essentially what it is, is you get a chance to bet Spelunky dollars, not real money, on how we're going to die. So you can go to that link and participate now. And while you guys go there... Um, The best thing to do would be post on Reddit. But once you got, while you guys are going there, I'm gonna unveil the top ten earners in Spelunky dollars for our community. Are you guys ready for this? So this is gonna be updated periodically because I've been saving the stats based on how you guys have been betting on previous betting rounds and the Dan Dan Geesing Live Game Show. Let's, let's let's check it out. So. Bringing up the bottom five, Brandon Meyer, Bracey T, Just Lyle, Just, Just Ye, Coach Cantor, Sub-Zero, and bringing out the top five, Fandango has won 730, Bubble Hale has won 1340, Piston Honda, 1448, Tim C, 1540, and C. Lloyd, C. Lloyd has almost hit five grand in Spelunky dollars, he is known as the Riverboat Gambler here in the community <laughs> so if you guys want to get your bets in do so now we're going to get this thing going though the the leaderboard i'll show it one more time this, our leaderboard is based on the amount that you've won on during this show so we keep the stats from this show and we update them and some of you guys may have lost a lot of money but this is just based on total money won all right, so let's get this going. I want to be a different character. What should we do? Now let's let's do it with uh, let's do it with our mans. What's up, son? I just found that in the PlayStation version. I think I told you that now. Oh, where do you get your bets in? All right, so get your bets in here. I actually have not locked in the bets yet, so you still have time. Go to there. Go to that link. Yeah, thank you for dropping that link, Russ. Appreciate that. Let's take a look at the bets here before we get going. Always like to take a look at the bet betting action. Okay, here we go. All right, so we got Grits207, Nancy M, and Amruth. Wow, Spikes is a lot of love for Spikes here. I want to see who's on Team Success. Majora Ryan is on Team Success. Dylan James on Team Success and Grits. Daps to you guys. All right, we're going to lock the bets in now, and let's do this. We are going to play a bunch of rounds tonight, so if you didn't get a chance to get your bet locked in this first try, um, I wouldn't... Uh, I wouldn't... Don't be sad because there's gonna be a lot of deaths. All right, we got nice campus to start. I like it. Usually, I don't want to jinx anything, but usually our first run—I always say this—our first run in any game is usually our best. How's the uh, voice to game on this? Ty Cooper, you don't understand everyone betting. Actually, let me let me address that in the next one, and then once I beat this level, 
so I don't want to get caught with our spelunkies in a bunch here. Thank you, sir. Just get all the monies. Get all the monies for the for the kids. You will not do that to us, sir. Okay, so, um, voice the game is grand. Thank you, Dylan. All right, so, the way the betting works is anyone can bet on whatever they want. It's kind of like roulette. So, if one, if everyone bets on spikes and we die on spikes, everyone wins. So, it's not like there's a certain amount of money that's paid out. If that makes sense. So, you're having problems with the stream, huh? We need that jetpack. So, that's kind of how it works, um, Ty. So you can bet on whatever you want without restriction. But usually, I will say this, usually betting on spikes is a good bet. All right, we're going to we're going to get greedy here. Cuz that shopkeeper, if we take this, the shopkeeper is going to get mauled. Uh, let's not get greedy. Ch change of mind. That mind change. Nice. Nice. Spikes just always make me freaking nervous. Yes, so depending on what you bet on, if you bet on spiders, for example, when I dive as a result of a spider, you win. So season one of Community Spelunky Bets are on. And right now C. Lloyd is in commanding lead. In a commanding lead. Destroy the shopkeeper. Nah. I'm gonna pass on that, Gwen. Because we, we have a solid run going. Nice. We'll save Bertrand here too. Knock him out, throw him out. There's plenty of spiders in this game, Wade, so no worries. They all have an equal shot to kill me. Arthritic Basher, what's up, man? That's an awesome name. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Get greedy. I am not getting greedy. I'm trying to beat this. We have not beat Spelunky ever. So those of you that bet on success, there's people in the community that always, in Spelunky Death Rebirth, they always bet on success. I don't know who you are. And we will, we will have a glorious celebration when that moment does happen. Make your move, sir. Nice. Six hearts. 30 G's. We got more than enough to buy the jetpack. Now it's just a matter of if we get a shot to buy the jetpack. If it's going to be offered to us. Whoa. Cheapskate. Sorry, lost the heart. We're okay, though. Whoa. Careful. Panic mode. This is like the anti-community game because everyone's, everyone's rooting for the failure. Yeah, and if, if you didn't get a chance to bet, that's not worth it. Uh, we open up new rounds of betting uh, after every death. So so even if you didn't get a chance to bet, you're probably still rooting for our death anyways. Let's drop it down here. Nice. Eat that, sir. There he is. Bertrand. We must save Bertrand. Where's the box? There's the key, but where's the box? I love getting that, that item that shows where all the good stuff is. All the rich stuff. Maybe the box is this way. There it is. Get in there. We're going to go get the key. Get the key. Hopefully have plenty of time. 
unlock the box. Oh, troll. We're okay, though. That's worth it. It's worth two bombs. Let's go, sir. The ghost is coming, though. The ghost is real, and it is coming. Oh, damn. Go quickly. Come on, dude. Go, go, go. Open it. Open it. We're out. Let's go. Bertrand's name is now Sir Thong. <laughs> Tiki trap. This run is decent. It is, YGG. I'm playing on a PC, YGG. I, I do have this for PlayStation 3. I often play this at home, too. It's a great game. I always wonder if I beat it at home, if that'll be disappointing or not. Because I don't get to share it with you guys. But probably not, because this game is amazing. I mean... Oh, God. Set it off, sir. Troll. Alright, I'm not even going for that. Arthritic Baw. Arthritic, what's... Basher. Oh, that name, though. Alright. That's not worth a bomb. All the gold. We've got a, a nice gold stash here, and we have a lot of hearts. We just need some good items here. There's a few goodies, and we got... Ah, just shut up and play. How do I freaking run into a spider? How is that even life? Don't touch her, sir. That's our job. Whoa! I think we're just gonna bomb our way in here. Let's carefully put her in her place. Alright, let's see if we can get anything else without... We don't have a ton of bombs, I don't really want to waste it. So let's just get out of here. Thanks, YGG, I appreciate that. What's up, AIM? Yes, we did beat Meat Boy. It was glorious and very lucky. What's a guy got to do to get a freaking jetpack around here? We are going to buy the climbing gloves, though. I'm a fan of the climbing gloves. Appreciate that, Aim. Who saw it? Is anyone gonna beat me to the punch? What? How did he freaking hit us? I don't know if we can save Frank in this one. What? No. God. I got so fixated on the tiki guy. Damn, that was a good run, too. All right. So we died via trap and via tiki. Five people bet on the tiki. Who was it? 1780 paid out to Coach Cantor, Fandango, Dylan James, 2000 DTM, and Bubbles. The rich get richer. All right, we're going to open this up to another round of betting. The moderators will drop the link so you guys can get your bets in. I can't believe that freaking Tiki. Damn. Oh, that was a good run. All right, so the, the betting is back open. I'm hoping that one of the moderators can drop a link because I don't have it cached right now. We're going to pick a different character. Awesome. Thanks for dropping that link, Kevin. Appreciate it. And I'm going to surprise you guys with a different character while you guys are getting your bets in. We 
We've had some luck with him in the past. Wow. Okay, here we go. Let's take a look at the bets here. Fandango. Betting the house that this is going to be a win. Domination on that. Majora Ryan, Derek K, Dylan James, Geo Jam, Amruth. Thank you guys for voting Team Success. Everyone else, you guys are all voting for Spikes, and you're probably going to win a lot of money. All right, we're going to lock the bets in here. Let's do this. Bets locked in. All right, so I'm going to play. I'm playing with Trevor from Grand Theft Auto. Uh, this guy reminds me of Trevor. I don't know why. The bets are in. Okay, we're going to do well with Trevor. I feel like we always have a nice run here with Trevor. Like jetpack runs. That's the only thing Trevor knows. You love your spikes. Spikes is like... That's like betting on red or black in roulette. It's 40% chance of success. If you bet spikes or tiki. Those are really, really strong possibilities. Unless you kill him off. Nice, Amruth. I don't want to spoil anything. If you guys have not seen uh, the playthrough, we did a playthrough of Grand Theft Auto 5 on YouTube. It's uh, I took some heat on how I chose to handle the ending, but such is life. All right, we got to get up there. Damn, I'd love to get that that blue diamond, sir. Certain. We're actually pretty close. Um, they have certain built-in metrics. So if we hurt... Um, oh, God. Shut up and play. If we hit a certain number of subscribers, which we're really close to, we get to add two more emotes to the channel. Why am I even worrying about that? That freaking rock. Yeah, you can walk through the spikes, you just cannot land on a prodigy. Like that, sirs. Man, we're down to two health, that's... That's brutal. It's alright, Trevor bounces back. Let's do it. Daps on that, Amruth. All right, thank you for that kiss, Bertrand. We needed that that life up. Travel Hopper, long time no see, sir. Good to see you back. If you're just visiting us for the first time in a while, we have a little spelunky death through that going on where you get a chance to get involved and bet your hard-earned spelunky dollars on how we're gonna die. I'd like to buy some rope. I'd like to buy some of that rope. I guess, why do we need rope when we have the climbing gloves? I, I did not need to provoke those peeps. Provocation. Oh, come on. We need a health upgrade. It's alright, though. We got this. Still no jetpack. Looks like the game is on your side. I would agree with that statement. Oh, waste of bomb. We gotta save him. Have to save Bertrand. 
Watch out for the spikes. Do my best. We need that jetpack, Majora. Jetpack is going to equal a strong run here. Have I seen The Hobbit yet? I recently just saw the first part in Unexpected Journey. I liked it. I think I gave it a 7 out of 10. And I have all my movie ratings on IMDb. Um, I gave it a 7 out of 10. I'm looking forward to the second one, though. That big spider. Oh, damn it. We may have to buy him just for a little help. Why not? Actually, you know what? You can never give up in Spelunky. I'm taking that back. We've had... I've had runs where we were down to our last... Our last heart. And things have looked up for us. But not like that. Why? Why? Alright. Damn. Okay, so. Let's, uh, we died as a result of that. It says arrow, but we died because of the, the snake. So we died because of the snake. So let's see who, who put snake. No one guessed snake. 1800 Spelunky dollars were wagered on that round and they're lost forever. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, we're going to fire up a new round here of betting. So the one of the mods will drop the link and I'm going to take a quick break, get some fresh air, get refocused because we're going to have a successful Spelunky run. So if I could ever sway you to bet your Spelunky dollars in one way, I'd bet on success. I'm going to take a quick three minute break. I'll be back. For a few more, well, we got plenty of time. We'll do a lot more Spelunky runs here. Um, so get your bets in. Be back shortly. <laughs> 